Let's talk a bit about Germany, because Germany clearly um, is in the um, 30th year of reunification, and some commentator are arguing that the next chancellor should be more active also on the geopolitical level by, for example, increasing military spending. Um, they call Germany the reluctant hegemon. Would you say that more active leadership is needed going forward? We have to do the necessary things for developing our common future in Europe and in the world. My view is that the most important answer to that from a German perspective, is a successful European Union. So a more perfect union is something we have to work on, especially when we understand that Germany with its size, with the population we have, with the uh, economic strength, is, uh, is right in the center of the European Union. So we have a responsibility. On the other hand, my view on the world is it will be different as some people think today. It is not that we have a situation which is uh, after the bipolar situation between USSR and USA in, in the post-war period is now something similar, something sim similar with the United States and China. There will be a lot of countries that, would, that will look for influence in the world, still Russia. There will be all these Asian countries like Korea, Japan, Vietnam, Indonesia, Malaysia, Malaysia India. And there will be also big countries from Africa or the Latin America. So in this world, cooperation and the rule of law is of essence. And the European Union would have to play a role to make this happen. And it is absolutely clear that in this world, which will be the case in the next 20 years, it is necessary that we have a sovereign and strong European Union. If you were to become Chancellor of Germany, would you then um, say we need higher taxes to prepay all the debt which we have now taken on? The situation Germany is in, looking at the debt we take now for fighting against the crisis, is not too difficult if we compare it just with the situation we had after the financial crisis following the bankruptcy of Lehman Brothers. We, at that time, Our sovereign debt increased up to more than 80% of the GDP and uh, it decreased then down under 60. Now we will not have an increase like that. It will be lower than 80%. It will be possibly even lower than 75. So it is absolutely clear that with a good growth we will be able to tackle the situation Alongside of this, it's absolutely clear that uh, a country can face a situation like this crisis only if there is a fair taxation. And this is even more so if you look at the situation after the crisis. Especially because it seems that this crisis has uh, made those who are already rich even richer because the capital markets has also performed so, as well and those who are anyway poor even poorer um, in that respect, uh, higher taxes for the rich would be something which makes sense, right? My view is that uh, anyone that is now seeing that we give direct support to, to a lot of companies uh, understands that it is necessary to have a fair system of taxation.